What, what can men bring to the conversation about Planned Parenthood or women's bodies or their choice? I'm curious. Well, gender itself is a social construct. Uh, whether you're, you know, whether you, you've been socialized to think of yourself as male or female. And, you know, you may not fit into either of those binaries. You know, and I think today we're much more alert to the fact that some people are non-binary. Some people are trans. Some people are, you know, feel that they don't, that they're fluid uh, in, in their own gender identity. And, and that's, that's a whole, you know, that's a whole other conversation to have. Sure. Sure, but we absolutely. have grown up in a culture that has that has a gender binary, and so, um, but and that binary is all about power, and who holds it, and so in order to have equality, uh, in any respect, it's important to have all of the people at the table, who, in, in a in a community, in a culture, in an organization, or whatever, and so that's the reasoning behind it. Is you want to have you want to have, and, and you know what we know now about, uh, we know now that, for example, businesses that have more women in their leadership make more money. I believe that. Businesses, I believe that. The other piece of that is that businesses with more diversity in general make more money. And so I think for any organization, you want to have, you want to have diversity. You want to have different kinds of people, not just gender differences, but, but you want to have, you want to have uh, ethnic and racial differences. You want to have cultural differences. You want to have uh, age differences. You want to be able to have many different perspectives at the table in order to do the best um, innovation, creativity, uh, solve problems, and be able to understand, look, we live in a diverse society. So we need to have, we need to have everybody at the table working together to solve whatever problems we're trying to solve. So, I mean, that certainly includes gender diversity. Absolutely. No, I love that answer. Mm -hmm. I think that's, I think that's fantastic. That, that makes absolute uh, the most sense uh, to be frank. But my first thought was, well, what's a guy doing at Planned Parenthood? Yeah, what's he going to do with this? You know, guys yeah, did have something to do with friends. Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's usually that's, the case. I, yeah. I, I think you need a little more education, but uh, I'll see what I can do. I'll send you a book. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure it has pictures or I won't understand it. <laughs>